video games can tell stories that enthrall and inspire us. But like many things in life can be even better with a friend to experience it with. I'm Will from Game Rant, and today we're talking about 10 story-driven games you can play in co-op. Number 10, Borderlands 2. Who better to kick off the list than the series that pioneered co-op looter shooters as we know them? Borderlands 2 gives players plenty of options both on the map and the character select screen, with plenty of options for every playstyle. With a party of two or more players, all the loot on Pandora is yours for the taking. Number 9, Baldur's Gate 3. Is it any surprise that the best game of 2023 is also one of the best multiplayer games out there? Baldur's Gate 3 lets a party of up to four adventurers set out on a massive and in-depth fantasy journey, either as a custom character or as one of the original characters that we all know and love. It even gives players a chance to suggest dialogue options during conversations for other party members, meaning everyone can be involved in the choices made. Number 8. Crusader Kings 3 What better story than the one you write yourself? Crusader Kings 3 gives players a myriad of goals for each kingdom that they can play as, but they can also choose their own destiny and destroy all who stand in their way. And with multiplayer support, you and your friends can ally with each other or fight to decide who is truly the mightiest. Number 7. Brothers – A Tale of Two Sons Brothers – A Tale of Two Sons is a puzzle-based adventure game in which you control two brothers in a beautiful world inspired by European folklore. You and one other friend can play together taking control of one brother each on their journey and help or hinder your companion throughout the game. Most versions of this game involve sharing a controller and using the different joysticks to control each brother, although the Switch does have dedicated multiplayer support. Alongside the carefully crafted puzzles and stunning environments is a story that brings the emotions, so maybe ask your friend to bring some tissues. Number 6. Stardew Valley Stardew Valley is, for many people, a chance to escape from the hustle and bustle of the modern day by supplying a healthy load of fulfilling tasks and charming townsfolk. But you can also bring your friends along for the journey and aid in building up your farm. Slay monsters together, split up to manage the day more effectively, you can even get married to each other in-game. Although you don't get the same benefits as you would from marrying a town member. Number 5. Divinity Original Sin 2 much like the other Larian title mentioned on this list, Divinity Original Sin 2 has a lot of the same positives going for it. An expansive RPG world to shape and explore? Check. A chance to create whatever character you want? Check. Bringing along your friends to add to the chaos you can create in the first place? Check. Number 4. A Way Out it's only fitting that Brothers, A Way Out, and one other Haze-like game that we'll get to later all grace this list. It seems that the developers have mastered the art of the narrative co-op experience. A Way Out also requires two players to enjoy this experience, so it's a perfect opportunity to bring your closest friend along for the prison break bro trip of your dreams. Number 3. Portal 2 Portal 2 is just one of those games that doesn't do a lot wrong. It took a great yet simple game like Portal and ramped up the scale so much that people still look at it endearingly over a decade later. And its co-op mode is no different, as you and one other friend take control of two test subjects as they complete puzzles and, more accurately, send their partner to hilarious deaths and get absolutely nothing done. Number 2. We Were Here we Were Here is very similar to Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes, in that it involves one player feeding information to another player trying to solve puzzles and gradually getting more loud as time progresses. This game also gives a small but overarching narrative that gives players a choice at the very end of the game. This game isn't as story-dense as some of the other entries on this list, but it can still deliver a fun time with a buddy. Number 1. It Takes Two Here's that last Haze-like game we were talking about earlier. Conveniently, it's also their most recent one. It Takes Two takes the co-op gameplay of A Way Out and builds on it to create a wonderful experience for you and one other player. The story covers a deep and mature subject matter as the player-controlled characters learn to reconnect during their failing marriage. Co-op is mandatory in this game as well, so grab that bunny from last time and get started. That was our list of narrative-driven games that you can play with your friends. For more games and articles like this, remember to drop by GameRant.com. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you next time.